Hey folks, it's me, Al, here again over at One Man Indie, and I am back with more Star Shift Monday. Yes, that's what we're going to call it here from now on, Star Shift Monday. And today, I uh, thanks to a, a, a tip from Doug, I uh, have a way of going back to the spaceship if I need to be here. It's a bit lonely in the station, hopefully more people will be able to help to... <laughs> I got a call for you, mama. Anyway, this is Al, a one-man indie, and I'm back with Star Shift, and I'm going to heal myself up after we got our butt spanked. A little bit. <clears throat> a little bit. Down on the surface of, of uh, what was it, Proxima something or other? No, I need, I need, I need outer space healing, man. Come on. That's what I need. That's that. Thank you. That's what I needed right there. Oh, that's, that's that good stuff right there. All right, so it looks like we need some uh, uh, better armaments. I thought I had fleet operations, ground operations. I need to go to the armory, I think. Armory, there we go. And see what we can get in terms of for the other two guys, I think. Hmm? That's interesting. Hmm. Because these guys are kind of weak. Well, you know what? Maybe I'll just kind of just go down there and see. And maybe we'll just level up a little bit. Wait, what's, what transporter room is for this? Going to activate the console? Okay, we'll be. Oh, okay. Because when I used that MagCon transporter, it transported me to the ship where the other guy was at. And this is the way you're going down. Okay. Be ready. I think I, I, think I am. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Okay, so let's go back down here again. I don't think we should have to go through the whole team like the oh, I guess we do. Let's move out. Okay. Yeah, whatever that least I think we, we kind of need to... Uh, do something here to kind of Polarion needle. He still doesn't have enough charge. Just, I think we might need to actually do some kind of a little bit of leveling up. I think, or maybe we don't have enough people. Death from above, power transfer. I think that the. I think maybe these guys are maybe a little bit kind of a little bit tougher than uh what we than what we can actually do for at least for with the party we have right now damn that is a lot sheesh sheesh power transfer of scythe boomerang yeah yeah, still not enough. Scythe boomerang, combat steroids. Yeah, yeah. Not strong enough. Hmm. Randomly hits enemies. Maybe we can just go. Okay, so we got two of them out the way. Okay, well, you know what? I can deal with that. All right, so let's see what we got here. We can go back up there. Items, and now you can do it here in the key items. Key items, Metcon Transponder allows for remote teleport teleportation back to your ship. Hasn't been tested very much, save before using one. We already have a save there, so we should be able to.
And now we're back on the Dauntless, and then they're gonna go on back over there. So before, I guess before we leave, we can actually go to our own uh, uh, healing bay, right? We should be able to do, yeah, med bay right over here. Okay, hey, robot, healer bot. Yeah, I need, I need your help, brother. Come on. I will assist you. Healing complete. I kind of wish that, you know, like sometimes on Star Trek, they have uh, the ability to transport somebody directly to the uh, the sick bay or whatever. Like teleport Xbox E to the sick bay, yada, 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 stuff, stuff, stuff like that. I kind of wish we had that, you know? Well, oh, well, I guess we don't. Oh, man. Ugh. My day is starting a little bit later than it really should because I got up a little bit late. Or later than I really should have. It's wait, wait, armory. Because I want to go into the, the Proxima thing, but man, oh man, oh man. I need some armor. Okay, so for me, it's not going to do much. For Anna, it's not going to do much. For Jack, it's not going to do much. The G3 armor, that's 6,000. Sheesh. Uh, yeah, I guess we just don't have it. Personal shield that we come in, we don't have enough as of yet. Man, oh man, the Shevitz. I guess, let's see. For Evo. For Jack, he needs the pants. <coughs> hmm. All right, uh, so we'll just equip him. So he's got the pants now. What about your sister? Nope. No accessories, no nothing. I wonder if they're just supposed to be just straight victims. Is there anybody else we can get to come along with us on this to make it a little bit easier? <laughs> just a bit. Just a bit easier. Maybe kind of, sort of. What? Oh, that's armor. Kevlar pants. Yeah, it ain't, this ain't doing nobody no good. So sell these. Oh, we had two pairs of those? So let's see if we can buy maybe. All right, we got 80, 86 or 1800 here. So let's see. So she could use the tactical boots. So give her the tactical boots. I like boot boots. Optimize her with the tactical boots. You sell said boots. Leather. Plastic leather. Pretend leather. <coughs> All right. Charge capacitor. Users charge as remains filled after battle. Uh, that's not bad. But let's just see something here. I need, like, in terms of like defense, especially for her, because it seems like the the monsters seem to like really like going for her a lot. Huh. <clears throat> So yeah, the personal the, the, the PS3 personal shield, you need six thousand for that. So the tactical boots for Evo Nine, Evo Nine. I need those boots so I may be able to find my brother and with him conquer the galaxy. 
Hmm. I mean, I guess that's about it. Hydraulic boots. Sheesh. I mean, I guess we're going to have to sell them. Not getting, not getting much out of them, but I guess that is what it is. So I guess we're just going to have to just suck it up. Oh, wait a minute. Power our way through it, I guess, to the best way we can. Where's the med bay? Med bot. By the way, what you doing with all this money that I'm giving you, med bot? I'm watching you, man. Cubes of nutrients. Uh, 25% is not good. 40%. The advanced med kit. Uh... I mean, I guess we, we got a whole bunch of other stuff here. Hey, man, you want some, uh, you want some, like some tearing lungs and livers and stuff like that? You want all that, uh, you want all this good human meat? It's very delicious. It's delicious. Fangor, Fangor stew. What do you mean? What do you? What, what do you mean? You don't want that? Why do you say it like that? Huh? Why do I talk in this language? Huh? Why, do I, why do I say it like this? You don't. You, you don't like it? Huh? <laughs> All right. So we got fourteen hundred. So we got stem gel. We don't have enough for the epinephrine mist. I think maybe I'll buy. Because it looks like we're, like we're going to have a need for just about all of it. Repair node. All right. So I think we're just about where we need to be so let's kind of save sweet all right so we saved let's slide slide slippity slide on ourselves and over here uh-huh yeah 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 hope everybody is having a good monday i know we're getting close to the holiday season Everybody's getting ready for a turkey day. We got our turkey in the fridge and a couple of other things. Wife is going to be throwing the gown down yet again for another year. Well, thanks for the turkey day. So it's going to be a good one, hopefully. All right. So, daggone it, man. <laughs> See, they're always going. Why are they going? For her, though. And for him. All right, so. I mean, let's go for it. Oh, I thought it was, it was all of them, but okay, fine. I thought it was going to be a whole. You know what? All right. That was a respectable attack. I gotta give it to you. That was a respectable attack. Uh, and tries and assembles the enemy with. Okay, so get him up out of here. Get him out of my sight, this rubble scum. Let's try it. Oh, yeah, not quite. All right, Anna. It's all on you, girl. You, you booty butt cheek. <clears throat> uh, I mean, I guess you'll still get some, uh, some, I guess some, uh, what am I thinking of? Some experience, I believe. Okay. Yeah. Cause she got, she has one HP now. You booty butt cheek. Learn skills. So he has 
1900 knowledge now so let's see defensive but that's 3000 okay scientific nope engineering unlicensed android uh yeah i'll take that yeah i'll take that too so he learned that temporarily put systems into overdrive resulting in increased performance across the board temporarily put system into overload resulting in increased so what's the difference uh i had to pay double just to get 50 just to get 25 percent better i don't know bro you might <laughs> it was just a little cheated just a bit kind of sort of a little bit just a little bit huh okay what about everybody else you no no you 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 definitely are too fragile I think healing is probably your best bet. Healing and what else? Maybe meditation. That's probably best for you because you are a bit too squishy. Too, too squishy, too, too squishy. All right, so now, uh, leader. So let's see what he has for the leader skills. First responder, okay. Field surgeon, probably a good one two to have. We only got three hundred some out left, but that's fine. That's fine, buddy. All right, so now combatant, what does she have? Offensive focus, defensive focus, evasion focus. Not enough. Huh? Increases the use of offensive capability. I'll go with that. Because you know what? Uh, having the ability to kind of... I don't know about steel. Engineering. Maybe that might come in handy. Alright, so offensive. Terran. Unlicensed. Engineering. Scientific. Healing. See if I can try to make him a good offense. Maybe make him a good offensive tank, maybe. What's this? Wait, hold on. Fires a powerful graviton burst requires both charge. I mean, heck with it. I'll take it. Why not? All right. So I think there's just about everybody taken care of in terms of using their skills. We're going to use some items on her med kit on girlfriend here because she got bit up. Something fierce. Everybody else is fine. They seem to like be able to be able to know, to know who to focus on, I guess. Now, I don't know if that was part of the game. Like if, uh, if, if, if Psychronic actually programmed it in such a way that they actually are able to know who's the weakest in the party or something like that why do they put why did they put a communications ray in a cave anyway how stupid it was built for emergencies the array is connected to a geothermal energy source how are we going to get past the blast doors we do what we always do blow it up baby okay let's blow this up setting the charges okay nice transition there very nice you set that up with an oh boy you got the the, the godzilla sound effect or the, the lizard sound effect <laughs> man a tissue regeneration technique leading to speedy recovery power transfer um um yeah i guess we're gonna have the deuce we just gonna have to uh you know what defend with her because i got a feeling that he's gonna try to maybe try to victimize her 
So what's the special for him? Slash, draw fire, and we will focus the attacks and creating a distraction. Death from above! Ah. All right, so now you will see my power. Eh, heck with it. Power up, brother. Bitches are ready to go. Okay, so now what we got? Y'all. Oh, we got all kinds of like, we got special combat steroids, uh, medical triage, user grand, usual focus in battle. You know what? I'll just do the med meditation. That was a I, salute to you for that. That is a cool, cool uh, animation you did for that. Shout out to you for that one, bro. Defensive focus. Oh, it's on her. So it doesn't, it doesn't do it for anyone else. Okay, so let's see. I mean, we can try and attack. Eh. <laughs> Ow! Senor. Senor. I want to get in. Hey! That's what I'm talking about, baby. That's what I mean, baby. Death from above, yet again. Once again, one more again. Yeah. Once again, back is the incredible. Well, all right. Well, all right. Well, all right. There we go. Wasn't too bad. Armor plate segment. Junk. Huh interesting what about this over here first off let's kind of get everybody kind of topped off a little bit we gotta okay 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 all right okay and then uh boy mr evo nine it's cool that you separated the healing items into two different kind of categories and stuff like that you know one for like synthetic and one for like organic organisms. <laughs> you son of a bitch! Leave her alone. Oh, oh I hate you so much. See y'all, you know what? Y'all are weak for that. Y'all are mad weak for that. Get out of here. Oh, you know what? You butt. Come on, man. You got to get stronger than that. We can't be having that. Come on. Come on, play. We need, we need you to do a little bit better than that. There you go. A1, is, that's, how you, that's how steak is done, baby. That's how steak is done, baby. So let's see what we got here. Anything over? Nothing over. Oh, wow. So that was an ill advised move. <laughs> Whoa. Who do we have here? What is this room? There's a person in that pod. Hey, man. It looks like a stasis pod. I am detecting life signs from within the pod. So what are we going to do? Let's just open it up already. His uniform. It looks like first generation ESA engineer's uniform. Okay, let's open the pod and see what we're dealing with. Here goes nothing. Hey, man. Happy birthday to ya. Huh? What happened? You were in stasis. We woke you up. Why? Why did you do it? Why did you... No. Those about stars just left me behind. Who are you? I'm an ESA engineer. Nick Wallace is the name. Engineering is the game. No. <laughs> How did you end up in a stasis pod? I am with the ESA garrison station here, Proxima Division. Hmm. You know there was there hasn't been a Proxima Division in over 60 years. A Proxima Division was dissolved decades ago. 
decades. What the hell? It's already been that long? What's the last thing you remember, Nick? Man. We were expanding the virtual avatar network to this planet. The VCC wanted to maintain a tight grip. I was in the stasis pod. I was testing the avatar network. For some reason, I wasn't able to wake myself up. Damn, this is a lot to take in. I need a cigarette. <laughs> they must have abandoned the base while I was in stasis. They must have forgotten about me. Nobody woke me up until now. Everything and everybody I cared about, they're all dead. Yeah, pretty much, bro. We're sorry, Nick. I know it wasn't the news you wanted to hear. They might be gone, but that doesn't mean your life is over. That's right. I guess it's not so bad. Is there any chance I can roll with you guys until I figure out what to do? I'm not useless, but it appears I'm out of date. I mean, yeah, why not, man? Welcome, man. Glad to be of service. We need somebody on the extra, somebody extra on the team, another body. So, yeah, hop on. Join the party, fam. So glad to be leaving this piece of crap cave. I never want to come back here again. All right, so everybody get everybody together. Okay, so now, oh, not supposed to be able to walk over those pipes, but this is from, this is from XP as well. A lot of this stuff came from XP, which hey, look, man, I don't I don't knock you for. You got to do what you got to do. You use what you had. I can't wait to see what you do with it when you say you want to uh, revamp the uh, revamp this the game when it comes out next next year ish maybe. I'm actually using, waiting to see what you do with it. Oh, oh girl, you was weak. Mm 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 mm, girl, this ain't gonna cut it. This is not going to cut it, girlfriend. You can't be uh, You can't be rolling with the, with the crew and be weak now. You can't be doing that. Ow. Sheesh. How could you possibly miss this thing as the size of a freaking Mack truck? How can you possibly have missed something that huge? Sheesh. Okay, so... And Mr. Mr. Wallace. I am William Wallace. Wait a minute. Let's just save. No, 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 no. Yeah, cancel. Save. We're going to save the game. Salvaje. In Spanish, what you would say. Uh, all right. Juego de Salvador. Okay, so now we got there's something here that we got to go to. But there's something else. Okay, I guess not. My curiosity was getting the better of me. Oh, wow. Auto save complete. This must be the control room. Everything appears to be operational. Finally! All we have to do is flip the switch, right? If only it were that easy. Okay, let's turn this thing on. So, girl, you know. You like Jodeci? Provide... 40,960-bit ink. What? Dang, gone. Any ideas, Nick? Those keys are only provided by the Prime node. Excuse me. Which is located on Earth. Looks like we're going to have to go inside. Wow. 
What has infiltrated my realm? Presence not authorized. That's a cool face. I'm out. Okay, so now it's fixed in this one. Okay, I'm out. We need your help. This entity recognizes your kind. Designation, Terran. Parent organization, Earth Systems Alliance. Earth Systems Alliance classification, Temporal Anomaly. Well, tem Temporal Anomaly Origin, the Prime Mover. Prime Mover classification, Enemy. Uh-oh. This entity cannot assist the enemy. We're not with the enemy. Where did it go? My lovely, where did it go? Okay, now this is cool. I like that. Definitely pretty awesome. Uh, what do we have here? What the Sam hell we got going on here? The crystal seems to be some sort of data storage device. There appears to be classification uh, characteristics of quantum en en entanglement. I'm also detecting temporal distortions. Nothing too serious, but we should keep an eye on it. We don't know how this thing works yet. Did Central Command mention where this thing came from? A trove of artifacts we discovered on Vega 2. This crystal, among other artifacts. Our scans indicate the crystal is roughly 100,000 years old. Some sort of lower civilization. Obviously more advanced than our own, obviously. Thank you for coming on such short notice. Subdirector Kern. Hmm. I'm a busy man. What did you want to show me? Watch this. You gotta see this. We have recently succeeded in interfacing with the device. We have begun to test some of the basic functions. What am I looking at? Originally, there were only there was only one embryo. Currently, we have only travel. We can only travel forward or backward within a range of a few minutes. The power requirements are quite significant. Are you saying this is some kind of time travel? Yes, but there's more. The second embryo appeared after I sent a signal to this computer uh, uh, console. I sent the signal with a temporal displacement by routing the signal through the crystal. Now, for the next part of the experiment, turning the computer off to prevent receiving that signal I sent a few minutes ago. Three, two, one. That should do it. We've never dealt with anything like this before. There could be profound implications. What kind of implications? Based on the data we've gathered from these experiments, We've determined that time is not exactly as linear as we thought. Both the future and the past are being affected simultaneously by the present in proximity to the crystal. A stunning revelation indeed, if true. Transfer the crystal to Station 11. We need to study this further. Yes, Subdirector. So we got a little bit of a glimpse into the past when he first started messing with this thing. So there's two embryos, huh? So this must be the so-called quantum chip. Now all we need is a dip. What about, uh, can I operate this? Maybe operate this. Uh, what about this? And maybe over here. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Mm, I mean, I guess that's what it is, I guess. What's that? I guess I gotta see what that is when I walk over there. Anything over here? Array Avatar Array Proxima node. So there is absolutely, positively, a nothing here. Well, well, well. Okay. He should be here any minute now. Administrator Ra. I guess when he was younger and lost an eye? That's interesting. I am hopeful that things will turn out all right. Well, soldier, what did you find? Director, it's gone. Everything's gone. Calm down, soldier. Tell us what you saw. Earth. Earth was destroyed. 
Destroyed? How? Some sort of weapon from species known as the Caltarians. That information is extremely useful. We still have time to prevent this. Thank you, soldier. You are dismissed. I thought they were going to, like, shoot him. <laughs> You're dismissed. And, like, they actually... The field test was successful. It was a success, subdirector. The cruiser appeared exactly when and where it was supposed to. Excellent. Order the cruiser to bombard the planet. Are you sure? If we destroy the Calterans now, we won't be able to predict the outcome. We're still new to this. We still have time. Screw that. The security of Earth is our top priority. It's worth the risk. Yes. Subdirector. I'll give the order. So you destroyed the Kyle Terrans or... Oh, a little bit of a conflict here in terms of the collision. Or the... So they were able to get this thing working with ships as well. Okay. So he transferred his consciousness into a robot. The attack was a success. Our agents report that Earth has well, has been saved, but there was unexpected problems. <sighs> what sort of problems? <clears throat> We've lost all contact with the cruiser. The space time location is un the space time location is unknown. <clears throat> Earth has been saved, but the Republic, our Republic, the Ten Republic, it never existed. We're not sure what happened. It has been replaced with something called the Earth Systems Alliance. Why aren't we affected? <laughs> I mean, like you're affected. You're coughing up a storm, brother. The crystal, the quantum chip, and its dip dipification, it seems to provide some sort of shielding against temporal distortions. That's some great dip. I'm, so I'm sorry to hear about the assassination attempt. Will you make a full recovery? <laughs> no, I'm afraid not. The damage was too severe. The memory transfer is being initiated later today. Cough. <laughs> transfer? You mean to an android body? As far as I'm aware, this process is still highly experimental. There is always a part of the original mind that is lost in the process. I don't really have a lot of options. Not at this point. <laughs> I'm dying, man. I'm dying. Ah, so now the plot thickens like old gravy. This is all your fault. We should have left you buried in the ground. I'm trapped in this wretched body and the world I knew is gone. What is this? Processing. A th one thousand, one hundred thousand, one hundred and three thousand, six hundred and seventy-eight solar cycles since last activation. Active status of brethren unknown. Huh? Physical entity classification Kern. Accessing entity memory Kern. I see. So there's more than one. The chip transferred part of itself into Director Kern. Huh. I believe he's the Psychonic said something like that too when he was doing his uh his, his, his streams. Our teams found the second crystal exactly where you predicted it to be. Both crystals are nearly identical. They are not identical. This crystal is nothing like the first. It must be separated. Initializing. Hmm. Incredible. You've managed to split the crystal's functionality without destroying it. I don't know how you did it, sir. It's groundbreaking. These smaller crystals should suffice for this purpose. The crystals will enable lag-free communications across the Alliance? Yes. Huh. Okay. The crystal shows... The console shows Crystal's lattice 
has been split into three parts. Okay, what about this? Uh, uh huh. Okay, so do I. The inscription reads Proxima node. All right. The inscription reads Liberty node. Okay. Prime node. All right. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay, so uh, we have that. And uh, okay, there's more uh, lore here we got to discover, I guess. The crystal just went dark. It must have been damaged in the attack. The scan is showing nothing but an ordinary crystal quartz or quartz crystal. Uh oh. Our defense fleet must have failed. We have to get out of here. The cave is going to collapse. Not yet, it won't. We can't just leave the crystal behind. There's too much research invested in this. We don't have enough time to transport the crystal. We have to evacuate now. We can seal the cave and come back for it later. <laughs> and everybody's routing. So we have to fight this. This entity will not assist the enemy. Hey, bro, bro, bro. We're not with the ESA. They're our enemy too. Presence is unauthorized. <coughs> so uh, what am I supposed to do here? Do I fight it? First off, let me kind of heal. Heal myself up a little bit so we have a little bit more space to work with here. Do we attack it or do we like defend? Maybe try defending. Maybe if we defend enough times, maybe it'll. Siberian, it says, now it says Siberian 6 down here, but the character said, uh, read is my name. So I wonder. Data regeneration. Regenerates corrupted data, data lock. I guess maybe we have to attack. Calm down. Dang on it. I said, I said, calm. I told you to calm down. You, you going to make me, you going to make me mad, man. I said, calm, said, calm down. Relax. Came in the island style, I said. You just, you just really want to. You, you really want to make this an issue, huh? I said, calm down. I said. Hey, you you want to be tough. All right, all right, okay. No problem, no problem. I got, I got you, I got you. Wait a minute. Let's see something here. Does not cause damage, but blue stops dead execution in hostile programs. Maybe do that. Uh... He's not dead. So that didn't do anything. I mean, I guess we attack. Maybe that'll cease the aggression. The aggression. Hmm. And we will destroy this entity. I'm not your enemy. Director Kern, the prime mover. He's planning something dangerous. We have to stop him. We can't do it without your help. You are not enemy? Yeah, not enemy, man. Not even close. This entity has been separated. The enemy is responsible. This entity is incomplete. This entity must be reintegrated. We can help you find the other crystals so you can be reintegrated. We need your help to stop Director Kern. We don't stand a chance without you. You may proceed. Let's get this baby on, baby. Time to activate the system. Let's do it. Com Ray Cave Cove. Information. All right. Communications array online. Yes. It worked. You managed to convince the AI? Yes. It wasn't easy. The logs contained in the system need to be analyzed. Director Kern is more of a threat than we realize. We have a lot of planning to do if we're going to have a chance. Let's get out of here. Indeed. 
Okay, a rising movement. Report to Admiral Bernard's office. Okay. We got to tell him Tell him he's a, he's a good boy. We have to tell him he's a good boy. You, you, who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Who's a, yes, you are a good boy. Yes, you are. Uh, so, hmm. Change. So it gives her more attack power, I think. Or do we give this to... Oh, we give it to him. Oh, he already has one, doesn't he? Yeah, he already has one. Can he put it in the other, in the other hand? No, I guess not. Alright, so let's go to... Her... So, it's a bit of an improvement. Desert Falcon. All right, let's get on out of here. And prepare to do it uh, to it. Yeah, this is just an empty room. All right, so we're just going around. We'll walk around it this way. We already got the stuff that was in here. Nothing else here that I can see, I don't think. We're just coming around like this. I remember when everybody used to think it was a big deal when you did the Caterpillar script with uh, RPG Maker, like a 2K3. Man, those were the days. RPG Maker 2K, 2000 to 2K3, when that, when that first came out, man, everybody was like, oh, this is crazy. We can actually make our own games. The games that came out of that, man. <laughs> The games that came out of out, out of that type of that that time period, man, that was a special time, boy. I don't think we'll ever get that kind of time like that, get, get a time like that back ever again. Man, I miss those days when you can just people were just making just any old type of thing and just throwing ideas against the wall, and just seeing that they stuck. Man, I miss those days. I really do. That was a special time, boy. And we'll never get that back. Uh, can I help you? Ain't you that chick from? I finally found you. You didn't think I was going to let you let, let you go, right? Because if you, I lost my station. You have quite the debt to repay. As I said on the station. You violated my rules. Therefore, you are mine now. I meant what I said. Who's this psycho? And he's just cool as ice with it. He don't even care. Artemis Reznor. It's a long story. We were her prisoners. Psycho? You too, Evo 9, have all I've done for you? I was a prisoner on your station. You didn't help me. Luckily, my little tracking device was able to find you. I want my ship back. I also need ex exclusive access to Proxima Node. You know that's not going to happen, right? Hell no. We'd never turn over technology to somebody like you. Then you all die. Right here, right now. It's like, there's literally three of you. Oh, uh, okay, we got the little robot thing thingamabobber here. Hmm. I see. Okay. So that's how it's going to be, huh? Let's see what we got. Tissue regeneration. She's going to need that. That's not... It's a shame it's not some kind of a feel. Kind of deadly roulette. Fires a flurry of headshots at the, at the first enemies in sight. I mean, we're just going to have to... Okay, not bad, not bad. Draw fire. Graviton burst. We need 110 and 250 charge for that. Jeez, oh Louise. Get that robot up out of here. All right, so we're going to do Scythe Boomerang. Good job. 
And it's Anna, and she's going to do Combat Steroids Deadly Roulette. I mean, I guess we can try that. So we got two of those guys out the way. All right. Now it is time for me. I will do the most damage to you, human female. This was a bad idea. <laughs> what? <laughs> he said this was a bad idea. Uh, you know what? Let's give him an item to uh, revive. Uh, you know what? No, this is. Let's end this. He said this was a bad idea. <laughs> I love this guy already, man. He's awesome. Hmm. Polarion pistol. We got some dragon skin. Okie dokie. Uh, this isn't over. Yeah, it is. Damn, she's crazy. Crazy thick. No, I don't, let me, I don't want to say that. She appears to be alive. Take her back to the station. We can't take the risk. We'll take her back to the station. We might be able to get some vital intelligence from her operations. We should bring her back to the station. Proxima Station. Mission complete. Get us out of here. Transport our guests to the medical bay. Good to be back. Glad it's done. I hope the common raid was worth it. What a pain in the anus. Let's find Admiral Bernard. Let's see what makes this array so special. So we get him the rebel uniform. Dragon skin is a big, big improvement. And uh, let's see. Just because you don't believe that I want to dance. Don't mean that I don't want to. So let's see. So this polar, polar, Polaron pistol, weapon skill, Polaron needle, or sniper shot rapid fire. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. That rapid fire, uh, sniper shot too. You get two for the cost of one. Hmm. I think I'll go back to this and uh, equipment. See if I can maybe. Give this, maybe give him this. And what about, oh, he already has one already. Can he get another one? It's a shame you can't equip like two, two different uh, weapons and stuff, but oh, well, it is what it is. Uh, let's go to the med bay and see how everybody's doing. Let's talk to our guest. Oh, you're here. Can I have a word with you? It's about our guest. You can have a word with me about anything, girl. <laughs> what is it? I mean, what is it? What's wrong with her? Other than her psycho psychopathic personality. That's what I wanted to talk with you about. Over here. Mm-hmm. You're taking a while, girl. According to the scan... Artemis is suffering from one hell of a stimulant. Of an implant, excuse me. What kind of an implant? It's lodged itself into the vertical striatum. Or ventral striatum. In English, Doc. It's a part of the brain related to pleasure. What's the implant doing? That implant has created an exclusive link between Artemis's amygdala and her ventricle, ventral striatum. The amygdala is typically associated with aggression. In other words, she can only feel pressure by causing harm or pain to others. 
So you're saying she's not normally like this? Somebody did this to her? Apparently so. I can remove the implant, but it's a delicate procedure. I can have her in a chemically induced coma for now. Also, it's not just the procedure we need to worry about. What else? What do you mean, Doc? After the procedure, her normal brain function will be destroyed. I mean, restored. She'll remember everything she's ever done, but she'll feel differently about it. All, pe all the people she hurt. Whoa. It might take her years to recover. Or decades. Uh, I think we hit a snag. Okay, so it stopped. It's locked. So I guess we're going to have to <laughs> Alt F4 and then come back. All right, we're back. It might take her years to recover. Let's hope she has the fortitude to handle it. What do we need to, to get started? I need a medical Matcon M1 device. It will allow us to directly transport the implant out of her brain. They don't come cheap, though. Any idea where we can find this direct device, Doc? Any station which sells advanced medical equipment, usually an ESA station. Trade hubs also have them in the black market. Mm-hmm. I don't know how long it'll take. Well, I can't keep her in a coma forever. I hope you can find it. The procedure is too risky without it. I hate to ask. Hey, man. So we got to save Artemis. So we need to find find a Matcon M1 device. It has been discovered that it's an implant in the brain causing a psychotic behavior. In order to remove the implant, it requires a Matcon M1 device. Huh. So we got to find it somewhere. So how do we find it, though? Hmm. Location in the Proximus. Maybe it's in here? Okay. Now, I had to resave. I had to restart and do the battle again. This time, we didn't get the dragon skin armor, but we did get her gun. So maybe getting the dragon skin armor messed something up, maybe? I don't know. That's just weird. I kind of feel like I want to go back to do that battle again just to get the armor, and I might just do that off camera like I think what I'll do is I'll save it to like file 2 here so we can kind of move on with the game and then see if I can uh, maybe go back and get it and just go back and save it again and see if we can get to the dragon scale this time objective complete new mission you're back. Well done. Good boy. You got the AI to cooperate. We will now become a larger target. Another ESA officer? Uh, who the hell are you? Down, boy. I am Admiral Bernard. I'm in command of the station. You better be on your best behavior. You better be a good boy. Or we'll throw you in out the airlock. Uh, yes, yes, sir. We've been reviewing the logs you sent up, Al. Quite frankly, this state, this situation is quite disturbing. We knew Director Kern was dangerous, but nothing like this. Not only does he have his own memories intact, but he has somehow managed to merge with an ancient advanced AI, the Prime Mover. What are his plans? What does he hope to accomplish? In the logs, it seems he was looking for his brethren. What? You mean there's more of them out there? The Proxima Node AI is of a similar origin, but Director Kern split it into three parts. I was part of the original team that built Proxima Node. I guess there was an attack, which is why I was left behind. Central Command is going to regret not coming back for the crystal. Luckily for us, Central Command did not. The ESA has the Prime Node, Novus has the Liberty Node, and now we have the Proxima Node. We finally have a shot in hell to unite lawless space. Uniting lawless space? It's never been done before. This means that we can set up our own interstellar government, similar to the VCC or the NFC. 
That's a lot of responsibility. We have no other choice, Anna. Our people are getting killed out there every single day. My mother died out there. I know better than anyone. They have to, they have to be stopped. Power such as this has has had what well, has had the power to do good or great harm. I hope we don't become like the ESA or Norvus. I don't see that happening. Not after all we've been through. Oh, <laughs> you'd be surprised. There's not much time. ESA Central Command will detect the activation of the Proxima node. They will be coming for us eventually. But now, they'll be too busy slaughtering my people. That's right. Operation Galactic Storm. Yes. There's nothing we can do about it now. I was able to get a warning to my people. Maybe it will buy time for some of them. We must seek out allies as quickly as possible. Now that we, we're a faction to be reckoned with, what do we call ourselves? Do we keep the name? The Outer Rim Coalition. <laughs> Let's see what we call ourselves. Mm. Orc. You know what? Outer Outer Rim Confederacy Confederacy The Outer Rim Confederacy Not sure how I feel about the Outer Rim Confederacy either way but I'm sure it will grow on me Many of us colonies are in deep crisis If we hope to bring allies into Orc we need to do what we can to help them break free of their owners. I'll leave it up to the crew to decide where to go first. Outer Rim Confederacy needs more personnel in order to stand a chance against Novas and the ESA. Anybody that you can trust, recruit them. Any planet you can bring to our side, do it. We need every hand we can get. We have diplomatic, you have diplomatic authorization as represent, representatives of the ORC you are approved to enter into negotiations with other worlds. What if we run into serious ground forces? How are a few people going to deal with problems like that? We need an army. We have one. At the moment, it's very small. We shouldn't get into major battles before we build up our forces. They are ready to fight if necessary. You can find them training in the lower level of the station. Make sure to speak to General Claudia about the army's equipment. Outfit them properly before you send them into a bloodbath. The planet I suggest first is Primera. It's a penal colony owned by the Primera Corporation. In other words, a prison planet. Yes, that's correct. Even though it's very lightly populated, it's, it's a minimal security facility. The prisoners have some autonomy. We must free our brothers and sisters trapped on Primera. Take my advice or not, I think it's your best shot. For an early victory by the time you get back the encryption should be in place just in time for our first member world to join the fight on primera you're looking for a prison guard named fritz Vukov. zukov he's our guy on the inside be warned he's a notorious drinker good hunting bark, bark. be good boys and i'll give you treats so we got a free primera okay Huh. All right, so we got to talk to Claudia. <coughs> Excuse me. Claudia. Uh, ground operation. So what we got going on here. This is what we do. Would you happen to be Claudia? Yes, okay. Our troops are the best in the Outer Rim. However, we don't have the best equipment in the Outer Rim. Would you like to change the equipment of the troops? Or are we... We could, or are we requ we, mm, requisitioning new equipment? We need to requisition new equipment. I guess we'll do that. Bye. Uh, so I guess. 
TX7. So I guess we'll go with that and uh, we'll go with this. I don't think there's anything else. That doesn't really seem to. I mean. Uh, I think I'm doing this right, I think. Uh, I guess I'm doing this right. Because <laughs> I can't really, I can't switch it. Equipment, so I guess optimize everything. We just got equipment, but don't see any weapons. Hmm. All right. We lack the proper training facilities. Training on stationary targets isn't going to work. We'll take out those ESA Novus monsters. All right. We have to keep training. It's the only way. Yeah, man. You're going to have to keep working at it, baby. I mean, I think I bought the best stuff. I mean, it seemed like that was... Didn't really have much uh, much choice there. Not much option. I know I, 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 it took a while, but let me see if I can uh, maybe go down to Primera, I guess. And see what we can do here. I might be able to, to wrap this up maybe within a, a small amount of time. Right here. Okay, so save it right here. Okay. Everybody still. What do you need, human? Hearing medical supplies. Hold on. Bye. Yeah, we don't have much. Hearing. I'm hurt. Bad, Doc. I'm hurt. Bad. All right. So let's see if maybe we can, if we go down to there, maybe we can uh, get that kind of, um, that Matcon that we need for the doctor. Glad y'all made it back safely. We need to, we need to go down. Uh, so how do we get down? Uh, or do we have to go to Primera? Maybe we need, we need to go to this actual space station and go to Primera then. Do, 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 do. Cybernetic Arena. We're not going to do that right now. So let's go to Primera. Am I taking the helm? Yes. All right. So we got to go. What the heck is that? Are we going on? What's going on with that ship? Initiating scan. The primary power cord appears to be damaged. The ship is in an uncontrollable spin. Uncontrollable spin. They appear to be life signs. They're weak, though. The power cord appears to be damaged. We might be able to repair it. The ship's power with supplies from the Dauntless. We need to investigate. I don't know. It could be a trap. We should investigate the ship. Maybe we'll have another ship in our arsenal soon. What's the design of the ship? It's unfamiliar to me. The design is from the Belgian solar state. They design and manufacture their own ships and technology. They use a mix of Terran and alien technologies. Their ships are quite capable. However, Novus has more, are more powerful. Maybe this ship got into a confrontation. Beam over to the damaged ship. We need to figure what's going on. Yeah, let's figure it out. Officer Hagel. Transport primary team, including myself, to the damaged ship. Be ready to beam us out if anything goes wrong. 
yes sir and he's like transporting now he is oh so happy to be doing that and i've been waiting for this all my life oh thank goodness you're here whoa who are you we're here to take your ship it looks useful we want to help we're here we're with the outer rim confederacy we saw that our that your ship's power core was damaged Sergio is the name. Yes. They attacked us. They? Who attacked you? Novus Federation. They've occupied Belshian. Our beautiful Belshian. Our Beltane. Our home. Why did they do that? The war with the ESA. It caused Novus to run short on Hydronium. It's a vital catalyst in Novus, Novus ship warp engine. Excuse me. Beltane is abundant in Hydronium ore. We're also on the border. There was a surprise attack. 90% of the fleet of the percent of the fleet was destroyed. We barely managed to escape. When we came out of warp, they were waiting for us. We powered up the warp engines again, but it was too late. They beamed over a squad of Marines. The ship went on lockdown. Despite this, we managed to get to warp. But the boarding party seized the engine room. They managed to blow the core. We can't or we came out of warp in this system. The Nova's boarding party is still on the ship? Yes. I was attempting to gain transporter control to beam them into space, but no luck. The transporter system is severely damaged. I lost contact with the bridge hours ago. I hope they're okay. With more of us, we might be able to take out the boarding party. We need to get to the bridge, but the path is blocked by the breeze. There's a maintenance tunnel in the engine in engineering though. I'll clear the maintenance tunnel in engineering. Please do what you can to secure the other areas of the ship. All of our lives depend on it. All right. Battle time. All right. So let's go and do what we got to do. That's it. Take some of this booster glue therapy, baby. Special. Special. She doesn't have that. So let's see. Just gonna have to attack that guy, Novus Marine. Oof, that is that is sad. Really though? Really though, bruh? Uh-huh. Special. Rapid to fire. How did you miss? Special deadly roulette. Okay. How dare you fire upon me? You know what? <laughs> the way she said, I'll see you in hell. <laughs> that, that's kind of funny. I'm not going to lie. Nova's Marine C. All right, any special attacks? Polarion beam. Okay, so it doesn't, it doesn't have that wide beam attack like he used to. Let's take this guy out, I guess. What? Come on. Okay, so that takes out, what? Come on now. Scythe boomerang. Okay, gets them out of the way. Bammo. Okay. Ah! Not enough. Come on, man. You got to do better than that, bro. Okay. Everybody needs to get a little bit of healing. Goo. Okay, I gotta start using these grenades. Oh, that's energy. I don't need. We don't need. We don't need. Uh, uh. Oh, that's health. Never mind. I thought it was energy. Never mind. So I need to start using these uh grenades and stuff. So what about this this, this door? Oh, we just came out of there. Never mind. Anything over here, maybe? You, you rebel scum. 
items. Use a pulse grenade for all that. Uh huh. Interesting. Deadly roulette. Not quite. Items. Another pulse grenade. Let's do it to it, baby. Oh, really? Uh, heck with it. <laughs> Use the pulse grenades. And let's start lowering down the numbers a little bit. And you're done. See ya. Anything in here, maybe? Uh, what? Man, I didn't expect to do that. Come on now. Screw that. We need the uh, pulse grenade. What else we got here? A hydrogen grenade. Wasn't expecting to be finding robots on the place. What you doing, man? What's going on here? So we got another one. We'll go with the pulse grenades. Figure I might as well use them. While we got them. No need being precious with them. All right. Well, all right. Well, all right. Well, all right. And we got some credits and some other stuff. Hey, uh, you guys okay? We're so sorry. Our attack drones thought you were the enemy. Uh, uh-huh. Gotta get out of here. Gotta get out. Gotta get out. Calm down. Calm down. Wow. That fight was intense. Uh, okay. Anybody here that can heal us, please? We should have been more prepared for something like this. We... How could we have been so stupid? I mean, you don't know. I'm not coming out until it's safe. Call me a cow if you want, but I'm still alive. Hey, man. I mean, it is what it is, bro. Uh, what about any stuff on you guys? Those rockage? What about you? Can you heal us? I hope we can make it out of this alive. Noah's is so strong. Okay. Uh, all right. So... If we're going to do this, let's make sure that we got ourselves at least some kind of a uh, little bit of healing here. I don't think we don't need it for everybody. I think maybe um, that epinephrine shot. Raw cannabis. Timeless. Of, uh, I mean, cannabis oil, anyone? Eh? Yeah. Eh, yeah, cannabis? Well, it was a little bit of cannabis, man. Who doesn't like a little bit of cannabis, baby? You sons of bitches! Get, uh, get out on the ground now! Please don't hurt me! What? Sir, who are these guys? We don't have time for this. Get rid of them. Oh, uh, you know what the deal is. Plasma grenade away. Okay, we do another plasma grenade. Mm-hmm. Deadly roulette. Who you with? Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, man. Special puncture. Let's see what we got here. Uh, you know what? Let's not waste that. Let's just do a regular attack on yes, that guy. Good. He got him up out of the way. Sweet. We can do Scythe Boomerang. 
Got those two guys out the way. Ow, come on, dang on it. Special. Rapid fire. Oh, I guess they weren't next to each other. You know what? Just just get this ended. You should be able to do it with this with the Okay, good. Oh my gosh. Why are you so weak? Okay, and we got some got some medical supplies out of it. Cool, good, good, cool, 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 cool. All right, so now we save you guys. We should have trained better for something like this. Don't worry about it. You all right, Beltane? Our beautiful Beltane. How could this have happened? Easy. Thanks for saving us. I thought we were dead meat. So is there any place where we can like heal? I'm, the Marines took us by surprise. Our crew isn't trained for this. Okay, so we got some stuff over here. Tissue regenerator. Stem gel thingamabobber to, to heal, I guess. So we'll just use the stem cell thingy to heal up some folk. Who needs it? Who needs it? Uh, she needs it. Who else? Can't use it on him because he's a robot. No, uh, 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 repair node for Mr. Bot over here. There's too much debris here and the bridge to go this way. Okay, so let's just take this dude out. Got him. Ah, can we use how many of these pulse grenades do we got left? We only got one left, so you know what. We can do it with the deadly barrage, uh, roulette. Not too great, but not too bad either. You know, you're really getting on my nerves with that, Playboy. Really, really getting on my nerves. Special. I should have given him a different gun that had the uh, Polarion needle on it. This guy, get him out of here. Sheesh. Anything, uh, power transfer, draw, not enough. So, you know what? Maybe go for this guy. What? Still not enough? We need to find like a med bay or something like that. This will make, oh really? Come on with that, man. That's BS. You know what? Plasma grenade it is. Away! All right. And let's see. Rapid fire. Randomly hits enemies. Let's see what happens. Oh, baby. That's what I'm talking about, girl. Anna with the save. Come on, man. You got to do better than this. Come on. Come on, player. Come on, player. Uh, you did all right. You did all right. Okay. We got some boots. We got some medical stuff. You know, okay. Improvement. Improvement of some sort. What's this? And the thing is, we got to be ready because you don't know. Hold on. He needs it. He needs it. Anybody else? I think everybody else should be more or less good, right? The team should be okay. Uh... Hold on. We got skills. Learn skills. So Android skills. He learned both of those. Blackmail. Metcon double. Yes, please. Steal something from the enemy. Mm. In addition to blackmail, I mean, I guess we could try that. All right, we can do that. All right, uh, engineering. So, okay, so you can transfer power, charge, power drain. You generates the user's power source by stealing it from the enemies. A. Hey! Okay, what about this? 
an advanced positronic repair technique leading to his uh, speedy recovery for synths. Okay, so we got something nice. He can help out uh, our Android friend over here. Sweet. Leader. First responder. What's this? Toxicology. With a, with, when a medical emergency happens, you are able to find the source of toxins quickly to save lives. Passwords can unlock additional dialogue and scenarios. I mean, uh, okay. You're great at fixing random stuff. Use tape and bubble gum, get it done, unlocks additional deal. Okay. Interesting. And uh, modest charisma, you're able to get at finding out what people want and using it to your advantage. I mean, if that's what it that's what it takes. Okay, so now for her, I mean, I guess irrational hope. She learned that. Have her learn steel mug. She got that. Okay, so she's done. So for him, offensive learned cover fire. Railgun drones. Woo! That was sexy right there. Do I do the same thing for her? Combatant. Uh, let's see. What's this? Muscle memory. You exercise regularly in the regular spring into battle immediately. Uh, yeah, I think that'll be a good one. That'll be a good one to use. So we'll save this. Maybe the three. Let's see what we got. You novice rebel scum. Hey boss, check out this loot. It's got crash, thrash, and haze. We hit the jackpot. We're in a combat situation, Frank. Hold off on the fun until we've completed the mission. Uh, you guys are done. You do realize. What the hell? Oh yeah, you guys are done. You like you realize that, right? Oh, you, you don't you don't realize it yet? Steal something from the enemy after injuring them. So let's see. I mean, I guess this guy. Oh, we took some money from him special draw fire railgun drones oh yes Ooh, baby that was some sweet sweet damage really okay so special polaron needle Blackmail. This is, this is, use intimidation to blackmail. Scare the enemy. Hurts your reputation. 500 credits taken from enemy. Overdrive. Overload. Matcon Devil. She has like the. She doesn't have a lot of uh, defense. So give her a Matcon Devil to kind of give her extra defense or something like that. I mean, you know, you guys are pretty much in for it, right? Like you, you, you guys cannot. Uh, uh, you know, I need 30 charge for that. Not a problem. What? You know what? Come on, man. This was a bad idea. You booty butt cheek. You do that to the one guy who was getting ready to die anyway, but I mean, fine. Wait a minute, hold on. What kind of special we got? Rapid fire, uh, charge stimulant, Matcon, sniper shot, damages the enemy. I mean, ooh, baby. All right, so now we got some stuff over here. One Beltane armor. Okay. So who do I give that to? Who do I give it to? Who could use it? Who could use it? Probably he could use it. Change. Rebel uniform. Beltane armor. Yep. Probably could use it. All right. 
and maybe give her better equipment. Oh, it's the same uniform. Never mind. All right, so I think we just about got to the right place, I think. So do some healing real quick. Uh, let's see what we got. We got Crash, Rage, Raw Cannabis. Who doesn't like in that raw cannabis, baby? Raw cannabis. Oh, he can't. He can't. Woo. And synthetic cheeseburger, organic boost. A boost for breakfast and insure for dessert. Somebody get the pancakes. I just drink the scissor. That right there to make a grown mango berserk. Oh, I'm sorry about that. That just. <laughs> That just made me think of that kind that, that Kanye's uh, uh, first release. The bathroom in the kitchen. Have we have we heard back from the boss yet? Not yet. It's been hours. What? Yeah, man, you're surrounded, bro. And you know you guys on the ship ain't gonna do nothing to help, huh? You're just gonna just sit there and just watch. Just gonna, not gonna do nothing, huh? Just, just sit back and just relax, take it easy. That's what's, what's gonna happen here. This how this works. I need thirty charge, and he doesn't have enough. So you know what? Psychological draw fire. I mean, I guess we can do that. Hey, hey! You taking fire? You wanna? You got a problem? You can fire on me. Uh, we can mug that guy. The foam goes straight to your brain. Mug root beer. Don't ask me why I thought that was a good idea to say right there, but it just seemed appropriate. What? You know what? You guys get on my nerves. Get out of here. Okay. You guys all right? You guys are strong. I hope that's the last of them. Probably not. I hope that's the last of them. What about... Uh, you know... Those Novus bastards hit me with the butt of their plasma rifles. And yeah, they got you good too, Jack. They smacked you good. The Novus are barbarians. Uh, I mean, I'm not coming out of hiding until the situation is over. Can we, any food we can get in here maybe? Any, any grub, any grub, any goodies? You guys are not going to give us any kind of goodies at all. How do you do it? I mean, we just do it, baby. This is what we do. When will this nightmare be over? It'll be over when it's over, baby. Oh, I gotta sorry about that. All right, you know what? I guess it's gonna be a little bit longer then. Okay, so we're now trying to get these guys off of this cruiser. This is going over a little bit. Almost it's almost two hours now. So that's been I didn't think it was going to go on that long. So sorry about that. Anyway. I got really wrapped up in the game. So I hope you guys liked it. We'll get back to this later. I don't want to make this too long. So if you did enjoy this and if you like the game, if you do it, are enjoying Starshift, this is Starshift Legacy. This is the Alpha Fort. This is something that's going to be coming out for the director, not the director, the, the, the developer, 2024-ish maybe. <clears throat> He's currently working on Starshift Rebellion, which is going to be released hopefully right about the later, later part of this year. And starship origin is already out already so if you do like these games make sure you go down support the developer he's a great guy doing great stuff let him know how he's doing and uh yeah make sure to hit the thumb subscribe ring the bell ring it twice make it nice so the notifications i mean so the algorithm can bless your boy and so my channel can grow and if you like what i've done please let me know in the comment section below how I've been doing and on that I will see you on another on the uh, the other side have a great one bye bye <laughs>